don't know about Ellie Darby, she's my favourite ever YouTuber and she's having a meet up today, literally she's the only YouTuber that I watch all of her videos, she's just so down to earth, yeah really hard working and yeah I just love her. So I'm meeting her today which is super exciting, so I will catch you when I'm in London. separate trains because we're, we were in different places yeah okay so you're wondering <laughs> what happened but yeah we just got off an embankment and we're just making our way there and it's like a mile walk but yeah it's not too far <laughs> and we're super excited yeah. oh my god I can't believe we're going to meet any Darby I know like wow I'll be nervous will you be yeah. nervous oh yeah yeah of course I'll be nervous and guys I've got the big clip trend for the first time in my life and I really like it June hates it well she hasn't told me directly she hates it today but I know when she's seen it on other people yeah she really hates it but I actually love it so it's nice like this because it's like on the side but I'm just not keen on it when it's like six clips all around your head it just reminds me of being like seven years old <laughs> and like yeah so I'm not too keen on it but I like this yeah. this looks nice I've got like a pink tortoiseshell one and a gold yeah so we're just going <laughs> see you when we get there <laughs> <Bye>. <laughs> for that now so we're gonna be seeing it tonight 7 30. just like it makes sense because we're in london and like we're probably not going to come back again for a while so, so we might as well end the night on a high go and see a show like i said i've been wanting to see it for so long so 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 excited and we've got really good seats as well yeah we're in the stool row f which i think is like fifth row or something mm. so Guys, did you know that it's actually cheaper just to buy it? Yeah, yeah, At like the going direct than on the internet. So, pro tip. So yeah, we've just got a few hours to wait. So I think we're gonna go to Cafe Nero and see yeah. if we can charge our phones because we both have terrible iPhones that don't have battery. No. So yeah, we're gonna we're go both across on the road zero. now and go and charge them. So yeah, we've got a bit of time to go. But it's not too bad. It's yeah. Got some time. I think people are coming out of another show, so yeah, I'm in the way. Stopping for a coffee break. Okay, so we just went to the Strand Hotel, which is opposite the Savoy Theatre, for some lattes. We were trying to go to 
Starbucks, Costa, Pret, Cafe everywhere, Nero. Cafe Nero, nowhere had charging points. So I was just like, June, let's just go to a hotel. <laughs> and you know what? We had table service. It was a very plush, luxury hotel. All the staff were lovely, and it's the same price as the Starbucks anyway. So, guys, if you're, and it was like Oasis, it's calm, they're playing jazz music. It's like a little respite from all the hustle and bustle of London. So yeah, instead of going to Pratt, why not just go to a nice hotel and yeah. relax? And they had charging ports. Right yeah, they had charging seat. ports under every and single every seat. seat. So, you know, so we both got to charge our phones. They baked us fresh scones. Yeah, and I only wanted one, but they gave us four. Yeah. And the lattes as well were really nice, good size. Yeah. The service all was great. The service. Always asking us to want anything else. Like fourteen pounds. I'm pretty sure I've spent more than that. And got like the same. Yeah. The pasta and got like way less. And got so. a paper cup. A cute, yeah. a rude yeah. barista, yeah. and a cold drink. And crying babies. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So I hate like really fiery, spicy, bitter things, and that's everything that this is. So I'm going to hate this. And how is this a shot? Because it's really quite thick, by the way. How is this a shot? Huh? I don't know. How's Your it? recommended daily dose of ginger. I don't know if I can do this. Bombs up. Shall I hold my nose? No, no you'll mess up your makeup. Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, I'll just do it. Down, knit. Okay, give me a countdown. One, two. Not backwards. Oh, three, two, one, go. Oh. Go on. <laughs> can show but I just will. <laughs> yeah, we are what are we five, six rows? Anyway, we're really close. We're seven, we? it's still close. And June and I were saying that we usually always go to really big oh yeah June and I were saying we usually always go to really big theatres. So it's quite nice to go to a smaller theatre because we're so close to the action. Like, yeah. Yes, we're gonna feel those vibrations. Um, so yeah, super excited. I don't actually, because June's the one that's wanted to see Waitress for ages. So I don't actually know that much of the backstory. I just know it's about the Waitress and she's <laughs> pregnant. <laughs> so this will be a novel experience because I know nothing about the show. And hopefully, Joe Sark is gonna be in this. He is. I saw him on the face track side. <laughs> So yeah, we're gonna see Joe Sox. <laughs> Joe Sog. <laughs> Joe Sog. I'm gonna see him. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna see Joe Sog. And yeah, I don't know any of the other actresses or I know nothing about it, so I'm super excited. How do you feel? You know a lot more about it than I'm you. very excited. I can't believe how close we are to the front. And as you said, it's such a small theatre, so we're gonna be able to like really feel everything. Like, oh my, I can't believe I'm here, like, I just can't wait to watch it, and I know I'm going to cry, probably. So, I'll um, stop annoying everyone around me now, and I'll chat to you later. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. So, we are back from London. We had a really, really fun time. Waitress was so good it was so entertaining the singing was brilliant joe sugg did an absolutely amazing job i think it's his first musical ever so yeah well done joe sugg um <laughs> waitress was hilarious so um yeah if you want to check it out definitely go check it out we had fun at the meetup. Ellie made such a big effort with all the food and sweets and everything. And the decor was so lovely. 
Um, unfortunately, June actually ended up getting stranded in London. Um, well, I we both caught the tube together, but we caught it different directions. I went back to my boyfriend's house because he lives in London, and then <laughs> June went back to the train station. But unfortunately, all the trains got cancelled. So um, I think I was on the tube when she was calling me, so I didn't hear it. Um, but when I checked my phone, I saw three missed calls from her, and I was like, "Oh, are you okay?" And she's like, "No, I've been round to three hotels, and they don't have any space." Um, and she was gonna stay over at my boyfriend's, but then she wanted to get back to Birmingham because she had work the next day, and she, her car was parked somewhere, so she ended up getting a taxi all the way back to Birmingham. Uh, bless her. <laughs> but uh, I think it was alright in the end. I, I still need to catch up with her and see how she's feeling about the whole affair. But yeah, we had a great time. Thank you so much for watching. If you like my face, if you like me, then definitely consider subscribing so we can see each other again. I upload videos every week. So yeah, I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day or evening or whatever you're doing. Lots of love. Bye-bye.